Welcome back to Knack for it, all YouTubers out there. Mac Destroyer here with another Neato episode for you. In the last episode, I showed you how to install Windows, and I installed Windows 10 using a USB flash drive. This video is going to show you how to get Windows 10 onto a flash drive so you can install it the same way. So stick around and check it out. This video is all about getting Windows 10 onto a USB flash drive. What you'll need is, of course, a USB flash drive, and it has to have at least eight gigabytes free or more. So if you have yours, let's get started. Once upon a time, we used these floppy disks to install software. Those faded and they turned into slightly smaller, harder disks. Then came the CD or compact disk. And those worked great for a while, but again, time, has done what it does and it's begun to fade away the CD days. With much cheaper and reusable flash media, it's likely that we'll see these dull ninja stars fade away altogether very soon. That being said, we're in a new era of software as well. Today, if you want to get a copy of Windows, you just head on over to Microsoft.com and download it from them for free. And they let you use it for free. Yeah. Now, if you want to unlock the full features of Windows, of course, you'll have to purchase a CD key and activate Windows that way. But they do give you the option to pretty much use all of Windows 10 free of charge. The only thing you can't do is change some of the personalization settings and some of the, uh, the security settings, which I'm not that fond of. But they've got to get something out of you. So to begin this process of getting Windows 10 onto a USB, you'll want to head on over to Google and type in Media Creation Tool. Click that first link that says Download Windows 10 Disk Image. Click on the Download Tool Now button. Or you can just click the link that I put into the description in case you don't want to head over there yourself. When the download completes, go ahead and open it. And then make sure you plug in your USB drive to your computer. When the software opens up to the license terms and agreements, click on Accept. On the next screen, you'll want to choose the Create Installation Media for Another PC option, and then click Next. Now choose the language and version of Windows you would like to install and click Next. Now select the USB flash drive and click Next. If you're stuck in the past or you just have no other options, you can also choose to burn this to a DVD to be installed that way as well. Now select the USB drive that you're using and click Next. And here we patiently wait for Windows to do what it does and install it to the USB drive. When it finishes, it will tell you your USB flash drive is ready. Click Finish. If you open up the contents of the drive in your Explorer, you'll notice that it is now riddled with files. And you're done. So that's the new school way of getting the Windows operating system. And it's really not even that new school anymore. That's all for this one. Thanks for watching. Much appreciated. I hope you enjoyed it and possibly learned something new for the day. Go ahead and leave me any comments, questions, concerns, or recommendations for future episodes in the comments section below. Uh, hit the like button if you liked it. Hit the dislike button if you didn't. Subscribe to the channel to keep on learning. And um, thanks again for watching. Have a good one.